Hello my friends, welcome to the channel. It is nice to have you back. It's been almost two months since we upload a new video. Today we're gonna be restoring and trying to fix one of our regular customer tabletop replica zippos. This is not our original zippo. It's more like a replica tabletop zippo. As you can see, is as tall as the zip of the the big one and in length it's a little bit longer so one of my customers brought this uh, replica zippo in my store it's huge we're gonna be trying to change the flint filling it up and see if we can make it work and we're gonna try to clean the outside a little bit too it's seen a better days don't forget if you're new to the channel to subscribe and hit the like button if you enjoy this video the subscription will give you a chance to win our giveaway that we're gonna have at a thousand subscribers that would be a hundred dollars worth in zippo items and the lucky subscriber can choose from what we have in store so this is the bottom piece here let's try to take this apart so usually we have a screw in the bottom so if it's too tight we can use like a dime or a 10 cents coin but this is pretty easy to take it apart still has a little bit of a flint but we're gonna see how this one looks okay usually this one we have to put the flint and put this back in so we're gonna use original zippo items for this restoration they always work the best So we put the flint, put the rod back in. It needs to be pushed a little bit. And when we can get a grip, we can start turning it. And is good. We need to open the sip of fluid. Okay, actually, we can use some keys. So the process is the same as doing a regular zippo. But we make, we have to be a little bit careful. Let's see what is inside here. I think it's better if we pour a little bit lower. This lighter, I think it's a long time since it worked. It's gonna take quite a bit of zip of fluid. I'm not gonna fill it all the way because probably it's gonna be 
sitting for a little bit until we give it back to the customer. So a good idea when we fill a Zippo lighter is to shake it a little bit too. Okay. It's gonna need more Zippo fluid. As I explained, this is a huge lighter. We might have to put quite a bit of fluid. Bigger lighter takes much, much more Zippo fluid. Okay, let's check now. The wick looks pretty good, so that's why we didn't do anything with a wick. Hmm. Still having a little bit of problem. Probably needs even more zippo fluid. <laughs> this thing is massive. So it's almost like 10 times the size of a regular zippo. We're gonna go one layer down. Hopefully we can get this thing started. It will be very interesting to see it work. Probably is gonna take half of the bottle here. It's so massive. Okay, let's try one more time. Take it a little bit. There you go. That was a pretty big flame too. Third time is the charm. So okay. I'm gonna try to restore it and be right back. It came out pretty decent. Still needs a little bit more work. I don't know if we're gonna be able to take everything 100% out. We can't do too much about the sticker. This used to be a promotional uh, tabletop Zippos, I think that they used to give to good customers from that company. It's nice to be back. Stay tuned for more amazing Zippo reviews. Next up, we're gonna do the collectible of the year 2021. Stay tuned, subscribe, comment for a chance to win the big giveaway. Thank you for watching.